maybe. Hello again, Mrs. Platt. She's been very brave, Reverend. Sarah, you know Billy has the eternal love of his family and the eternal love of Christ. Thank you, Reverend. Sure, you're up to it. Sarah, I'm worried about. I've made a lovely job of the flowers, Angel. Be careful with him. He's in safe hands. She's only a baby herself, man. I thought this would be perfect for the wedding photos. Time to go. You were going to give me away. I used to dream of you walking me up the aisle. I never thought I'd be behind my baby's coffin. Quite a turnout from the neighbours. They'd turn up hanging with their own knitting, that lot. They were showing respect. Yeah, some were. Some were having a nose. I'm not hungry. Funny that. Sorry. My head's cabbaged. I don't... I know. The size of that coffin. I don't know who I'm crying for. You don't need it, do you, love? I'm not allowed to grieve for my own son. We're going later, though, yeah? Charlie said I can buy the van. Why have I got a skulk around? I'm Billy's dad. My son has died. Come on, Todd. Mum's right, they'd only say you'd hijacked it. Just something else to throw at you. Look, maybe we should go out a walk or something. The what, I'm taking my mind off it, yeah? But, Todd... Just leave it, eh, ma'am? I'll go and have a soak and just uh, get out of his hair, just to keep it. You said you'd keep an eye. What am I meant to do? Tie him to the chair? If that's what it takes, yes. Mum, let him do what he's got to do. I'll get dressed. Just bring the van round. Aye, aye. Don't even 
smoke. I had to come. It's your funeral. children to him in order that he might touch them and the disciples spoke sternly to them but when Jesus saw this he was indignant and said to them let the little children come to me do not stop them for it is to such as these that the kingdom of God will come have been better she's that brave wouldn't surprise me if she threw herself in after the little mite. Well, at least the father had the decency to stop at home. Don't show his face more like. To you, gentle father, we humbly entrust this child so precious in your sight. Take him into your arms and welcome him into your presence, for there is no sorrow nor pain, but the fullness of peace and joy with you forever and ever. Amen. Amen. I can't see him. He's here somewhere. There's plenty of room here. What are you doing here? David. We have entrusted Billy to God's mercy. We now commit his body to the ground. Earth to earth, ashes to ashes, dust to dust. Ensure and certain hope of the resurrection to eternal life through our Lord Jesus Christ, who will transform our frail bodies that they may be conformed to his glorious body, who died, was buried, and rose again for us. To him be glory forever. Amen. <laughs> 